Hi, this is Congressman Rick Larson with my weekly recap with Rick. I'm in my office in Washington, D.C., but really close to home in my district, District 2. And uh, I'll see you all on uh, Sunday when I fly back uh, to the district uh, this coming weekend. So a quick recap of the week. Um, this week, the House voted on a couple of uh, bills. We voted on one to hold Chinese officials accountable for human rights violations against uh, Uyghurs, ethnic Kazakhs, and other Muslim minorities in China. This is timely. Uh, China's, uh, China's been in the news this week with the new national security law that they're going to apply to Hong Kong, uh, another concern of ours from a U.S. foreign policy perspective. We also voted to expand the Paycheck Protection Program that we originally did in the CARES 1.0 Act, and that uh, those changes will help uh, small businesses uh, keep employees on payroll longer, and we made a few other changes as well to help our local small businesses. Tomorrow, on Friday, I'll be participating in a subcommittee hearing of my transportation committee. The subcommittee is the Coast Guard and Maritime Transportation Committee. We'll be examining the impact of the maritime supply chain uh, relative to the COVID-19 pandemic, and you can even though we'll be online uh, for the committee hearing, you can watch it streamed live at 10 a.m. Pacific Northwest time by going to the committee website, transportation.house.gov. And that's 10 a.m. Uh, back uh, home in Washington State. Uh, so there's that. And finally, this week marks the end of Older Americans Month and the end of uh, the Asian Pacific uh, pardon me, Asian American and Pacific Islander Heritage Month. Uh, so that's what this week represents. So in our district alone, there are 125,000 seniors. So uh, take a moment and thank a senior for their service to your community. And think about the seniors, especially in this time of pandemic. And uh, there's 78,000 plus people who claim uh, Asian Pacific Islander Heritage in the second congressional district. And I wanna thank all of you for uh, your involvement in your community, your continued service as well. So that's uh, this week's recap with Rick. Again, I'm flying home on uh, Sunday to come back to the district and we'll see you back home next week. Thanks a lot.